bolting the flex plate to the torque converter is a bit of a challenge you're going to need an assistant to hold the crankshaft bolt up front because as you spin these bolts it'll spin the flex plate first thing you gotta do is reach in and line up the torque converter uh, to this bolt hole might not automatically be lined up so you just got to line up the two and the only way that I was able to actually get this done was with the 3 8 ratchet but that wasn't enough because there wasn't enough leverage so I took this big silver pipe I put it on the end of the wrench like so and then uh, had the assistant hold the crankshaft bolt or the harmonic balancer pulley bolt steady while I cranked and there's three of them so uh, oh another thing is I put one in and tightened it and then the other wouldn't line up so I'd recommend finger tight all three of them and then go back to the first one and start again and that's it well believe it or not that is the starter after like a half hour of scrubbing so it was jet black I should have taken a before picture and now it's getting ready to go back in so now I guess I'm just stalling because uh, I hit it for another 15 minutes with scotch bright to clean it up a little bit more I don't know whether there's a noticeable difference or not time to stop procrastinating and put it in all right got the starter back in and it's just two bolts that go straight up. Um, only thing I did wrong on this one was uh, if you, by chance, uh, if you're just replacing the starter, you probably didn't take off the plastic cover. But if you're doing a rebuild and you took off the plastic cover, you gotta put on that little plastic transmission cover before you put on the starter. Uh, I did it wrong. I got the starter in there and, uh, and then I had to kind of reverse everything back out. The easiest way to get the starter in there I was trying to feed it from the bottom, but that, that did not work. So feed it in from the top. So from, I mean, I'm, uh, here's my fender well. So I've got that big uh, piece of plastic out, which makes access to pretty much everything super simple. You feed it from above, you can get in between here and the AC accumulator and uh, feed it tail end first into the uh, bell housing and it goes right in and then uh, that's pretty much it and then of course the uh, the lines and that's that that is the starter so all my major components are pretty much in with the exception of my alternator and my uh, throttle body so uh, next is basically electrical hookups